My name is Jairam Chuluru. I am from New Jersey, United States. Uh, we came to Nepal primarily to go to Muktinath. On our way, we saw Manokamna and Devaghat and Triveni Dham. And uh, we had a very good trip to Muktinath. The weather was very good. Primarily, the guide provided by Mr. Ganesh he is excellent. Sharad is very knowledgeable. And luckily, we had a very good darshan there. And Sharad was there all through with us. He took care of us. And uh, on our way back, we saw, on our way, we saw Valmiki Ashram. And also on our way back, we saw Vedavyasa's birthplace. And all through, Sharad was taking care of us very well. For our, all the needs, he was helping us. Hotels were very, very good. So that's all what I can say at this point. So I recommend uh, Montessori Truck and Travels to my friends, to anybody. Thank you. My name is Subarao Maturi. Myself, my wife, Vijaya Maturi, both we come from Atlanta, Georgia, United States. This is the first time we took a tour with Ganesh. And uh, I'm, I'm very glad to say we are extremely happy about the store. Till we decided upon coming here, we were not sure whether we will be able to make it to Muktinath or not. But finally we made it and we really enjoyed the, uh, enjoyed the whole grace of the Holy Land. The Muktinath and Paswadinath. Actually, I was planning to see Paswadinath in 2015. Unfortunately, my tickets were cancelled because of the earthquake at the time. So, so when I decided to come back to, for Paswadinath in 2017, we wanted to add Muktinath and saw Ganesh, the Sarad, the, 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 the guide who came along with us, they took care of us all through and we were very, very happy that I'm very proud to say the tour was a success. Thank you. Daman. And Daman. And he wrote completely, he doesn't speak, doesn't speak, but very silently he does his job. I'm very, very glad about it. <laughs> Thank you. Namaste to everybody in Nepal. Ganesh ji, namaste. namaste. To Sharad ji, to Daman, who has done a great job in taking us around. So we just want to acknowledge that uh, as a team, you people have done a great job. We are very happy. All of us are 70 years and above. So for us to have completed this successfully is a very big issue and we are very happy for that. And the reason we chose Valmiki Ashram because a little reading that I did on the internet, uh, it appeared to me this is a very holy land, very, very holy land where Valmiki, who was supposed to have been an ordinary dweller in the forest, who was looting people. He was advised by Narada. You all people know Narada. How can I get out of my bondages? Then he was told to chant the name of Rama. And then he says, instead of Rama, he says, Mara, 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 Mara. And Mara, Mara becomes Rama, Rama, Rama. And then he becomes the great Valmiki Rishi and who has composed the Ramayana, which is very important to all of us in Nepal, India, the whole of India. And so because of his composition and he taught his grandchildren, Lava and Kusha, who were the sons of Rama, who were residing in his ashram. So when this happens and uh, Lava Kusha at one time, he comes, he binds the horse, Ashwamedha horse, because they didn't know what they were doing. When this happened, Rama sends his army to release the horse, but everybody loses. Shatrugna, Bharata, Lakshmana, even Hanuman could not get back because the children were chanting Rama Nama. When they did that, then Hanuman gets bound and Rama also comes. So to me, this Valmiki Ashram is a very Punya Bhumi. Everybody has come here. Everybody has stepped onto that soil which is why I wanted to touch the soil. That is why my trip to Valmiki Ashram, although it entailed a little 
troubled trip, you know, like you cross the little river waters, you come into India, then you go back to Nepal, and you see the little real rustic uh, forest life of Valmiki. And seeing that, seeing the Sita Devi's uh, where she finally goes down into the earth. So all this, when we saw, we thought we have actually remembered every event of Ramayana. That is why Valmiki Ashram is very good to us. We are very happy. In addition to many other things that we have seen, this stands out to me. And Devghat. Devghat, where all the rishis were there. All the devas from Shiva's side, Trishuli River, Kali Gandaki River, Shiva's, Harihara, it is called Harihara Kshetra. So when all of them come and join there to prayer, it becomes an extremely holy land. And then it becomes a Narayani River. When the Narayani River comes in and we see the Gajendra Moksha Divya Dham, and we see all these Triveni Sangam again, I think we have reached uh, in our mind a highest pinnacle of satisfaction. Thank you.